everyone, so little quick Otobi update. Um, I'm keeping him. So, um, we've kind of been hinting at it all along, but I haven't officially decided it yet. So, it's official, we're keeping Toby. So, though I'm very excited to keep Toby, I want to upgrade his cage. His cage is 368 inch square inches. So, it isn't as large as I would like, um, so I want to upgrade it. And this is what I want to do with this cage. Um, I want to take this bin and put it where Toby's cage is now. And then I want to give him this whole one by two area um, of CNC grids for Toby to have. Um, and I'm just a little curious to see if anyone can help me uh, get a design plan. Sorry, I'm just trying to get this out. Yeah, it's hard to do one-handed. Alright, sorry, I'm not going to edit this video, so I won't be able to cut any of this out. Now, ignore all the poops and everything under here, but I want to make this whole area his cage, this one by two area. Um, so I know I plan on using tiles on the base um, of it, and I'll probably bring, I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I want to figure out a way to, um, raise this to, like, three grids high, um, I want, like, the walls three grids high, um, and I have a bit of extra coroplast, but not enough to, like, I don't think I have enough to, like, make a box with all of this, um, so I want to make this, like, three grids high, and then I want to have a waterproof base, but, I want to, I have to, I have um, extra mesh downstairs and I have to mesh these um, grids. And I also have to mesh these upper grids because there is a little gap up here and I don't want them to get through it. Um, so I have no idea how I'm going to be meshing these big grids because they are attached to my pig's cage and I can't take them out to mesh them. Um, so I don't know how to do that. And I'm also curious on if anyone has ideas about the door. Now, I'm going to be talking about this with my boyfriend and his dad because they like to build things. So, um, I'm hoping I'll be able to figure a way out. But meshing these top grids and these back grids just looks like a pain. Um, so, I don't think he'll be able to fit through that little crack right there. But then I had to make a door. And because I have the connectors, but I want the door to be able to swing open. And I don't know really how to do that. I know how to, like put the grids up because I have extra grids so I can cover this up but um, I don't know how to cover the grids up like I know how to put them in but that's about it so I have to figure out a way to latch the door open and close but that's just a really quick Toby update I gotta go now but um, if anyone has ideas on how to make this possible uh, just let me know and thanks for watching